Hi, John here from TV Licence Stop, and I'm back again answering some more of your TV licence questions. And today's question is... Hi John, I have a question for you. I regularly watch Alex Belfield's live phone-ins at he hosts on Wednesday and Sunday evenings. Not plugging it, it's part of the email. But I'm wondering, if I watch them live on YouTube, am I breaking the law by doing so without a TV licence? It would be a tad ironic considering Alex was the man who convinced me to cancel my TV license in the first place. Cheers, Daniel. Hi Daniel, thanks for your question mate, and it's good that somebody convinced you to cancel your TV license. Well done. Shame it wasn't me, but Alex is great also. Now I have dabbled watching Alex's show on Wednesdays and Sundays. I can never get through. Can you get through? I never ever get through. I gave up, I gave up trying in the end, really. But the answer to your question is in the title of the thing you're talking about. It's a television license. Now, Alex Belfield isn't a television broadcaster. He's not a TV channel. He's not anything like that. He's a YouTuber. And as a YouTuber, you can watch his broadcast live all you like. There's no problem at all. Me, Alex, anyone else you find like that on Twitch, stuff like that, all fine to watch normal people who are not TV channels broadcasting live. You can watch all that without a television license. Where it gets a bit sketchy is, you know, like Sky News on here broadcast live on YouTube as well, doesn't it? But you cannot watch that without a television license because they're a proper pucker TV channel and it's a TV license. So you can't watch that as it's being broadcast. You can watch the clips and stuff if you want, but you probably all know that already. But yeah, Alex Belfield's fine to watch. Watch all the Alex Belfield. You're like, no problem at all, mate. So I hope that's answered your question, Daniel, and I hope some other people watching may have got an answer to a question they didn't think of asking in the first place. But if you do have a question you're thinking of asking, you will find out how to do so in the links below. There's a bit to contact me and you never know, you might even get one of these little personalised videos just for you and your question. So you pop off and do that and I will see you in another video again soon. Thanks for watching.